hello guys good morning good morning from wherever you're watching this from uh it's a beautiful day and it's the 24th of december 2023 we are glad to see this day uh it's a time for family to come together so we're glad that uh, we are here to experience this day and we we thank god uh today is uh beautiful day and i'm in the village i'm in the village and uh if you're joining me for the first time my name is the village wanderer a vlogger from kenya and i vlog about everyday issues lifestyle uh culture travel so join me for more exciting vlogs and uh, today i'm just going to show you how we get water here in the village how we are able to get water, especially water for drinking and water for using around the house like washing dishes and those sorts of chores. However, for other uh, things that need to be done, say like watering plants and uh, cleaning the house, uh, we use rainwater or borehole water. So this is the purest form of water you can get especially for drinking because uh, it comes from from the ground very natural so welcome to the vlog uh, take this journey with me and see how we live here in africa but in the meantime just take time to appreciate the countryside and all the silence and the serenity of the countryside So, welcome to the vlog. Let's go get some water uh, at the spring. We call it a spring. Yes, at the spring. At the natural spring. This is the village. This used to be a granary a long time ago. Long time ago. And I was still a small boy. This is where uh, the maize harvest used to be put. And we'd go in there and really play and jump on the maze. And it was so much fun. It was like a custom-made bouncing castle. Where we'd go in and, uh, and play. And for those who are watching for the first time, this was my parents' first... Not first... Uh, yeah, we could say first decent house at the farm and uh, this is where they stayed and here is where we'd come and stay when we were here for the December holidays or when we came here to visit. So this is the house we'd stay at and that's the back door right there. And uh, if I may go on this side and this is the front door so this is the front door of the house so this is how it looked now it's a little bit old uh, it's actually a very old house but then it looked very magnificent it was a very magnificent structure at the time uh, we could say that is in the 80s uh, but now as you can see the front door has been barricaded and uh, this side is no longer used yeah those are stones for my village cottage when it will come up those are the foundation stones that i've been collecting so i just need to collect more materials and actualize uh, that that project and uh, that there is the workman's house so we are at the village and we are going to get some little water from the spring for 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 showering so the water today will be for showering very silent so i'm debating whether i should 
exercise this morning actually I should uh, but let me get this water for sure first and then we'll take it a step at a time so this is where the cows ordinarily stay and uh, all this extra extra padding was put because of their security so this is just to block off any potential uh, burglary burglary or theft because uh, sometimes there tends to be too much theft out here okay so we are going to get some what the spring nice beautiful morning out here what are you planning for christmas uh what are your plans for christmas are you in the village or are you in nairobi it would be nice to know or are you in the town where you work please comment down below what you're planning for christmas let us wish each other we wish each other a merry christmas uh it's a beautiful time it's a beautiful time especially for people to get together and to be together and just enjoy the company of family and friends yeah so I'm walking to the river I have my bucket and uh, we'll see what we call a river but it's actually a spring lots of agricultural activities going on there and maybe it's something I should go and learn and see what my neighbors are doing and learn a few tips and tricks on farming and uh, be able to engage much more Welcome to the village. Welcome to the village. It's very quiet. Very, very quiet. Away from all the noise of the urban areas, all the noise of the cars and the vehicles, and the air is also fresh. So, perfect day to just relax and do a little bit of uh, reflection and uh, engaging in things that rejuvenate the system so let's keep going and uh, get our water so christmas time in kenya africa I want to show you what Christmas is all about here in Kenya so stay tuned for a vlog on that on our preparations for Christmas and Christmas itself stay tuned for more of that uh, so that should be interesting because I know our Christmas is not like uh, maybe the way it could be uh, the western countries but uh, I'll be showing all that yeah okay it's quite a bit of a distance from the house to the river and uh, Here we are. Here. 
we uh yeah we oh here we are so this is supposed to be chlorine for disinfecting the water once you get it and uh, So this is a natural spring. Here is where most residents are gonna get their drinking. Yeah. Awesome. This is beautiful, the purest form of water. Let me So these are the steps which come down and uh, the natural spring water. Okay. Now let me get the water. Beautiful. So this spring goes down to the to the other side. Mm. So we know sort of uh, dugout place and uh, that's the water. So please leave a comment especially if you relate to this do we have this sort of thing in your village i know in most villages in western kenya this exists as a water point yeah and uh, this is for disinfecting the water but it seems like it's so there's nothing here So this is where we get our water. This is where we get our water. Yeah. Almost there. So we have our water. So this is for other people who had come here to take some water. And I think this is enough for us to take a bath. So what we do is I just remove it like that. Ooh. Ooh, let me just fill it up natural all free from mother earth this is mother earth giving us 
back you treat the environment well it gives you back you treat it terribly this water will dry up in a minute so I think that's enough and we shall leave <coughs> Yes, so if you've never seen a spring before, this is it. Uh, this is where we get our water here, primarily for drinking and cooking. So if you're coming to the village and you see something like this, do not be surprised. The water there is pure. In fact, it's much more pure than the water from a borehole. You'll find a lot of this in a lot of rural areas. Uh, in Kenya, I don't know about other African countries, but in Kenya, this is common. Uh, this is meant as a disinfecting station again for the water, but uh, it seems that the, the chemical that is there is uh, over. So, thank you very much for watching this vlog. I'll be bringing you more vlogs from the village just to show you the different things that happen here and uh, I hope you're enjoying them. So until the next one, make sure you share, like, uh, leave a sweet comment below. You can also consider subscribing if you like this kind of content. And uh, from the motherland in the village, uh, for now, I bid you bye-bye.